In the 30s, 40s and 50s, one of the colder spots this morning, actually Douglas waking up to 33. The rest of us a little bit warmer than that, but still you're going to want to have the jacket as you head out the door. This is a look at a time lapse from yesterday up in Summerhaven. I just want to show you the fall foliage coming through. We're starting to see more and more color up in the high terrain. So coming up, we're going to take a look at the forecast and what to expect when it comes to peak and when you should have, head up to the mountains. And right now, really, I would say, you know, get up there because we are going to be past peak here pretty soon. Fall foliage today about 50 to 70% change up on Mount Lemon. Same thing from Madera Canyon. We're at peak right now, so about an 80% change to almost 100% change for Mount Graham and Hannigan Meadow. Still a little bit behind for Ramsey Canyon and Portal. As we work our way towards next week, we should be near or at peak for Mount Lemon and Madera Canyon. And then by November 14th, past peak for Mount Lemon and Madera Canyon and right around peak for Ramsey Canyon and Portal. So get up there and send in those photos. All right, here's a look at what to grab today. We have a lot of sun sunshine on tap, so don't forget the sunglasses layer it up today because as we work our way throughout the day, it's going to warm up. So you'll want the jacket this morning, but you won't need it this afternoon. Of course, the coffee coffee on a Monday morning, right? And for all of you parents heading out for trick or treating later, you're definitely going to want to have that coffee for your temperature tracker right around 9 a.m. Temps will be in the 50s and 60s as we work our way towards lunchtime. Really nice 70s and 80s at this time. And then by about 3 p.m. our highs should push into the low 80s for the warmest spots. By about 6 p.m. tonight, if you are heading out to trick or treat, we should be in the upper 60s here in Tucson, so very comfortable, but a little cooler to the south and east. And then as we work our way towards 8, dropping into the 50s. So temperatures will drop pretty quickly and then it will be another cool start for your Tuesday morning. We do have some big changes on the way. Uh, this system dropping out of the Pacific Northwest is going to bring the wind by midweek and on Thursday. It's also going to cool us down by quite a bit. We do have a slight chance for some showers, but really not a whole lot from Tucson to the south. If we do see anything, we're only looking at trace amounts, maybe a tenth of an inch especially on Thursday. That's going to be our best chance for any rainfall. When it comes to snowfall, the best chance will be in the mountain ranges north of Tucson, including the Catalinas. We could see some light snowfall accumulation, mainly above 7,000 feet, but this isn't going to be a big rain or snowmaker, but it is going to really cool us off. Uh, 44 going into Friday morning, low 60s. That's it Friday afternoon, and then Saturday morning is looking like the coldest. Several areas to the south and east will drop below freezing again, so definitely plan ahead and have a way of staying warm by Friday and Saturday morning morning. That's a check of weather. Now let's go ahead and talk traffic.